Hey, what's going on YouTube? I'm gonna be doing a vlog today. I'm going to Boulder. Uh, last week I was focused on trying to help my grandma cure her lung cancer or at least treat it a little bit with some um, hemp CBD oil, some THC edibles, and um, just a bunch of diet stuff some hand and ear and foot reflexology, some cold exposure, which is what I'm doing right now. I played the didgeridoo on her back to loosen up the mucus in her lungs. And if you don't know what the didgeridoo is, it's basically like a long tube, like five feet long. And it's like that, like that thick. <laughs> and it plays really deep vibrations when, if you're good at it, I'm pretty good at it. <laughs> I, I'm not super good at it, but I was able to like get all the probably the best vibrations for that purpose <coughs> of lung cancer and like the mucus and the cystic fibrosis that comes along with it. I think she's gonna do all right. I left her my little black pyramid that I had. I was doing experiments on pyramids because I found out the Egyptians didn't build pyramids and we have no idea what the pyramids are used for. So I've been trying to figure it out myself and doing my fair share of research I guess as a human but yeah I'm going to Boulder today I'm going to be doing a sunset hike with my buddy David I might be going to Pearl Street to ask the people who sell metaphysical items in their shops like pyramids see if they know anything about pyramids and maybe buy a flute and a new didgeridoo because I left the didgeridoo with my grandma so my cousins could play it and uh, just keep giving her those vibrations she needs in her chest. But yeah, that's that's that for now. Oh, also I have a video coming up where I'm laying in the snow, in the rain, in 38 degree weather. And that was yesterday. It was the first time I got water on my skin in a long, <clears throat> in a long time. And that video was pretty good. My mom filmed it. I wasn't even planning on filming it until my mom did it. So that was pretty nice of her. And... Yeah, I got a new rain stick. It's a stick made out of wood that has beads in it, and when you turn it, it sounds like rain. So, that's that. That's the intro to this vlog. Have a good day. I'm gonna have a good day. My skin, I can't even see it on my camera. But, yeah, it's, it's a little scratchy. <laughs> but I got this new lotion made out of pinyon sap, I guess. And, I'll tell you more about that later because I don't have it with me right now but it's been really helpful uh, my face wouldn't be as good as it is right now even if it's not really that good um, if it weren't for that sap and if it weren't for that lotion yesterday no if it weren't for that cold exposure in the rain yesterday and snow <laughs> on my back I guess <sighs> All right, this cold exposure is wearing me down because I'm not breathing while I'm talking enough. So, look up the Wim Hof method if you want to expose yourself to the cold safely and with the most health benefits. I'll be back. YouTube, I'm in Boulder right now watching some Bright Insight uh, on YouTube with my homie David. Uh, yep, that's just the update. Adios.